controversy tonight after a police organization posts a disturbing video of what it describes, what it describes as, quote, the continuation of the thug cycle. In it, people encourage a toddler, it is the toddler's uncle, we understand, along with two others, who is in a diaper, it's a three-year-old, to say just about every vile thing you can think of. Here is some of the exchange with that little boy. You a <laughs> you, throw, you throwing a fit right now, little n***a? You f***ing hoe. F***ing. You f***ing. You two should be. Put that off. You ain't talking that f***ing down, f***ing you too. Say f***ing. So I say f***ing my f***ing. That's why you can't fight, f***ing. You a f***ing. So what is he from, what? Say f***ing douche nine. Wait a minute. What hood you from? Something's different. 16. He's a, he's a 16. Say my name three times. Joining me now to discuss the controversy over this is Wendy Murphy. She's the founder of the Victim Advocacy and Research Group and a New England law adjunct professor. Also, Michael, Michael Skolnick, who's a political director to hip-hop pioneer Russell Simmons and president of GlobalGrind.com. It's so awful. You, it's the same as watching them pick him up and beat him physically. Um, and now two controversies have emerged. Number one, no charges have yet been brought against anyone in that video. In fact, the only statement we have from police is that they're investigating it, but that no, nothing criminal took place on that tape. And number two, the police are now getting pushback, the Police Officers Association, which is different from the department, for posting it online and describing it as uh, the, hold on, let me get it. They say they had an obligation to share it, to continue to educate the public about the terrible cycle of violence and thuggery that some young, innocent children find themselves helplessly trapped in. Michael, let me start with you. Uh, on the latter issue, the police posting the video, they did not blur the faces, I understand it, but we did. No, I think it's totally inappropriate for the police to post this video. It's appalling and disgusting to watch this child say the things he's saying and for the adults in this video to tell him to say the things he's saying. I have a child. It is disgusting to watch that. But, 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 but for the police to post this video and post this child's face, it is abuse of the child. The child, they have no right to tell us how to raise our children. Their job as police is to protect our children, not raise our children. Wendy? Well, who posted it first? Where did the police get it? They didn't go break into the family's home and steal it. It was already put out there by this poor child's family into the public domain. And this was on a Facebook. responsible act on the part of the police officers because when this kid grows up and becomes a gangbanger and starts killing people and raping women, and that's the language of a child, not what he's going to do, but it's the, it's the messaging. It's the messaging. That, Someone's going to say, why didn't we intervene in this child's life sooner? Why didn't is, we see the red flags? Megan, These Megan. are really, really big red <laughs> flags, and yeah. somebody should intervene, and if it's not the parents, it's got to be someone. Go the ahead, cops Michael. should be Megan, applauded Megan and for Wendy. butting into this poor Wait, child's let him, let him life. That is precisely the problem of posting this video. The idea that you would think this child's going to grow up to be a thug and a criminal and hurt somebody just because of the language they use at two years old. That is a perpetuation of a that. horrible stereotype. But, Michael, no, let I me ask you on this. Let me, but let me press you on that point, Michael. If there is no intervention, what do you think is going to happen no, to that child? No, there should be intervention in this child's life. It's not to post a video he, on a website for a union. Do you agree that he is being abused? That is abuse it's, it's, on that it's tape. It's certainly abuse, and there's, there's, a, there's a set of procedures a police department should go through to, to investigate abuse. It is not to post a child's face on a website to the public and say, look at this, this is an example of bad parenting. That is not a proper where the procedure of a police it? department. Where, Michael, where did the police get Wendy, the Wendy, even the police chief of the, of the Omaha police said it was wrong for them to do this. You didn't answer my question. At all. I said, where did the police get it? They got it off the internet. But there's, there's right. hundreds of videos so of children swearing but on listen, the internet. They claim, they, claim, they claim that they needed to do it, that they wanted to do it, because they wanted to give people an unfiltered view of what, quote, we deal with every day. And there are, quite frankly, citizens, they say, that think this stuff does not happen. But it does. They claim it's an education tool to, to show there's the public that this is happening, this perpetuation of, you know, 
I don't know what There's it is. There's a much better way, Megan, to show the public what's happening than ridicule and pick on a really? two-year-old child. There's a much better way to do that. What's if you want to, if you want to rebuild the relationship, Michael? if you want to rebuild what's the relationship between the, the community truth? and the police department, this is certainly not the way to do this. Omaha has a history of bad relations with the black community, and this just puts a further pin. You know what? If somebody said, if ahead, somebody Megan. said, oh, this, this, there are toddlers in homes being told to say these things. You know what the response would be? That's a lie. How dare you shame Wendy, our minority go on community? YouTube and now type we in have baby a true swearing. video, and you're no, 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 no. But baby swearing people, is Michael. different. Baby go swearing is YouTube. not good, Michael. See, it's not good. But if you watch this tape in its entirety, you will be appalling. sick to your stomach. I've seen I mean, it. the it's abuse disgusting. of what they do to this little boy and make and with the, he gives the middle finger, and they're calling him ho, and they're using the p yes, but that's word a with him it's also and abuse, f Megan. you and on and on it goes. It's they are determined to to torment the child. And it's clear this isn't the child's first time on the receiving end of this. Here's the question I want to ask you both. We've got 10 seconds left, so I want to carry you over. And that is, where are the charges against the caregivers? That's next.